I'm here at the Rolls-Royce booth and I'm joined by Ryan. Ryan, thank you very much for joining us on Dubai Airshow TV. Um, tell us what Rolls-Royce is doing here at this year's show. Well, simply put, Rolls-Royce is here to highlight our presence in the region, the products that we offer to our customers throughout the Middle East and Africa, uh, and really just highlight how we are leading in the technology race to provide engines that exceed all of the market's expectations. We'll come on to this big trend XWB behind us in just a moment, but I, I want to um, cover just a little bit more about the footprint that you have in the region here. It's, uh, it's, it's quite a sizable operation that you have. It is. Well, I mean, Rolls-Royce has been present in the Middle East for decades. Uh, we go back all the way to the RB211 on the 747. Uh, so our presence here isn't new. Uh, but as our customer base has grown, so has that presence in the region. Uh, and we're now running a pretty significant office out of Abu Dhabi. We have a second office here in Dubai South, actually. And uh, we service customers all throughout the Arabian Peninsula and down into Africa and up into Central Asia. So this is quite an impressive centerpiece that you've brought with you to the show here. Uh, tell, us, tell us what this is and, and tell us the story behind it and why you're keen to make this the, the highlight uh, for visitors to your booth here this year. Sure, absolutely. Well, simply put, this is the Trend XWB, the most efficient large wide body engine in the world. Um, we're highlighting it because it powers the A350, which of course is one of the prominent aircraft in the region, um, and it's going to be growing over time. So. Uh, we're very proud of what we've done with this engine, so to bring it here as the centerpiece it only makes sense. But it is important to note that this is only one of a larger family of engines. Yeah. So the Trent family uh, spans all the way back to the Trent 700 powering the A330 Classic, uh, going to the Trent 500, the Trent 800, the Trent 900 which was on the uh, A380 with Emirates. Um, and then of course you have the Trent 1000, 7000 and the XWB uh, in our current generation of engines. And what is it from a, from a technology point of view and from an efficiency point of view that really makes this next generation of engines stand out? What, what, what makes it unique in the marketplace? Okay, well, all the engine manufacturers are working on increasing the bypass ratio uh, in engines. That's known to increase the efficiency. But what specifically gives Rolls-Royce an advantage is a three-spool design. So our engines, unlike the competition, have three counter-rotating independent shafts. That allows the engine to tune itself to the optimal efficient compression and combustion throughout the flight profile, which gives us additional flexibility and overall flight profile fuel efficiency benefits. Terrific stuff. Um, we're, a, we're a little while into the show here. We've been going for a few hours today. Uh, tell me about the kind of conversations that you've been having with visitors to the show here. What, what are the questions they're asking you? What are they most wanting to know about Rolls-Royce at the moment? A great question. The air shows are always an excellent opportunity for us to engage with customers face to face. Um, and every customer has different questions, different challenges, different expectations and needs. Uh, so to answer your question directly, they, they've spanned all sorts of different conversations. So we've had good productive conversations about the future. We've had conversations about our present level of support for customers in the region. And of course, there's been also the happy reflection on good relationships in the past and overcoming challenges in the past. And that's what these air shows are all about. And you mentioned the future there as well. So cast your mind forward if, if you are able. Take us into where you see your part of the industry going and, and how Rolls-Royce will uh, adapt to meet the needs of the industry over the next coming few years. Okay, so if we look at the next coming years, uh, based on the aircraft that have already been sold by both Airbus, Boeing, uh, and some of the other carriers, we will double the size of our fleet here in the Middle East. Um, so it's a high growth future for us here. Um, going beyond that, of course, there will be additional pressure to further increase fuel efficiency. Uh, so Rolls-Royce is already working on technology to incorporate a gearing system into uh, the next generation of engine, which we call the Ultrafan. Uh, we have information about that engine on our website if you'd like to look it up. Uh, but uh, that will be the next evolutionary step that we hope to bring to the region. But this is years in the future. Of course, we have uh, much to work on with deliveries of the XWB, the Trent 1000 and Trent 7000 uh, in the coming years. Ryan, thank you very much indeed for sharing with us this uh, fantastic exhibit centerpiece here and for uh, casting us forward a few years into Rolls-Royce and indeed the industry's future. I uh, wish you all the very best of luck for the rest of this year's Dubai Air Show. Thank you very much. It's been a pleasure. And for more insight and news from the show and beyond, keep it locked on the big screens here at the Dubai Air Show online and, of course, on social media. Thank you.